dirty. I want to see fluid everywhere. Let's get nasty. Big, big, big man. Ass. Want people to know your name? Do you got <laughs> What the hook is that, bro? Let's call me Master Zen because I'm a flippy bass. You see the title, bro. No, sometimes get into it. So, guys, what do you want to do today? I don't know, dude. I'm bored. I don't know. Ooh, you guys see that Kendrick Lamar's the halftime show for next year's Super Bowl? But, dude, it's going to be in New Orleans. It should have been Wayne. Well, Little Wayne hasn't made a song in 10 years. But everybody loves Lollipop. They remember the lyrics. Oh, yeah, I love that song. Lola licking me like a lollipop. Dude, those are not the lyrics, and that's not the flow. Oh, well, I don't know. The only rapper I know is Puff Daddy. Puff Daddy? Yeah. Obviously, your freak ass will know about him. You know P. Diddy? He's my favorite. I just hope he doesn't do anything illegal. <laughs> Breaking news, okay? P. Diddy has been arrested and charged with multiple heinous crimes involving women, men, a thousand bottles of baby oil, and hitting people and wrestling naked. Just a bunch of bad things. His trial is later today. Oh, come on, Puff. First R. Kelly and now Puffy. Why do all my heroes keep doing this? Remember when I used to just sit back watching the Cosby show with a Subway sandwich while listening to R. Kelly and Puff Daddy all at the same time? Well, now I can't do any of that because it's ruined because they just can't keep it in their pants consensually with people of the right age. The only thing keeping me going now is my dream of meeting rich homie Quan. He's the only rapper still alive that hasn't done anything wrong. Yeah. I don't repeat here, rich homie Quan, bro. It's not funny, bro. Yeah, that'll be the day. Do we tell him? Hell no, dude. He'll lose it. Tell me what? Uh, nothing. Oh, okay. I'm just gonna Google rich homie Quan <sighs> meet and greets. I just can't wait to meet him. Oh, uh, no, no, no. I, I wouldn't do that. Why not? Because, uh... I, I was thinking about Christmas gift ideas for you, and you just said that, so now I want to get you a rich homie Quan Mean Greek uh, for Christmas. Really? You do that for me? Oh, yeah, so just don't Google him. Oh, thanks, Junior. I just hope these accusations against Diddy don't stick. I mean, a thousand bottles of baby oil, nothing should stick to that. I mean, it's not like he beat up his girlfriend in the hallway at a hotel and dragged her by her hair. I mean, there'd be footage of that. Hmm. Hmm. How could... <laughs> That's the spirit, dude. Yeah, that, that, that definitely... That, that. What? Uh, no, nothing, nothing, nothing. Let's just sit here and wait and see what the verdict is on P. Diddy. Okay. Order, 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 order. I am the Honorable Judge Boomer. And today we will be hearing the case of Sean Diddy Combs, a.k.a. P. Diddy, a.k.a. Puff Daddy, a.k.a. Love. Mr. Combs, you are being accused of throwing freak-offs where you did unspeakable things to women. And men, yes. <laughs> and when the police raided your mansion, they found over 1,000 bottles of baby oil. In fact, uh, Bailiff, could you please search Mr. Diddy? I think he might have more baby oil. Mm, I like that, Daddy. Oh, scrambling and scraping and shit. Bro, imagine that you like you're sec you're a security guard and you have to frisk frisk this freak ass boy. Right, more baby oil. I thought so. Could you please check all of him to make sure there's no more that there is there's oh, in the yeah. sleeves? We'll check maybe the back pot even more, even more baby oil. What are you? Is that all of it? If you're sure that's all of it, we can move on. Thank you. Well, Mr. Combs, there's no reason for you to have that much baby oil. Bro, I just realized there's videos of this goofball calling other people daddy. It's like we disrespect. We dis. Everybody was expecting this goofball. Like he gotta be on some freaky shit, or he gotta be gay. Like why doesn't he come out? Bro, I, I think I saw multiple videos of this goofball saying calling people daddy, bro. And I'm like, bro, why do these people allow him to allow him to call them daddy, bro? What the hell? So I find you guilty. Hold on, Judge. Before you say anything, I would like to make an offer. $50 million cash in my mama's house paid off in my kids cell phones They don't need them shits anyway, and I won't go on Google anymore I ain't searching up anything and to top it off. I got a video of me piping Justin Bieber in Honolulu What you say judge? No, no, that doesn't take back what you did. All right judge How about this 
Me and you in the closet for five minutes, and you take that, take that, take that, take that, take that, <laughs> take that, take that, take that. Oh, I, I am sorry, Judge. He had more baby oil. I didn't search him good enough. I'm sorry. Guilty. I sentence you to life in prison. But I will give you 24 hours of freedom to get your affairs in order. Man, I only got 20. If they actually did that shit. Them niggas are stupid. Only four hours left of freedom before I go to prison for the rest of my life. What should I do? Should I say goodbye to my kids? Should I go to church? Nah, fuck that. We throwing the hugest ditty party known to man. One last hurrah. Oh yeah, the biggest freak off God's ever seen. I'm talking about prostitutes on prostitutes and more prostitutes. And don't forget the baby oil. Oh, oh, man ass. Did I forget the man ass? Ooh. Take that, take that, take that, take that. No, I wouldn't that. suggest doing that. No, oh, whatever. You're going to jail anyway. Breaking news, MK. P. Diddy has been sentenced to life in prison, but he has been given 24 hours of freedom to get his affairs in order. We have a video message from P. Diddy himself. Get his affairs in order? What the hell is you talking about? He's a crip. So, that we will play now. Hmm. Oh, what's up? Huh? Freedom to get his affairs in order. We have a video message from P. Diddy himself that we will play now. Mm. Oh, what's up? It's me, P. Diddy. See, they try to give me a lifetime in prison. But that don't mean a party is, because it never is. We having one final freak off. Freak off of the century. Make sure you're there. Uh, invite your grandma, your mama, your, uh, I want men, I want women, uh, more men. Oh, please, please invite the men. I need more men there. Uh, sweaty bodies, I got the baby oil. We about to get freaky tonight. Make sure you're there. Oiled up and uh, toyed up. All the toys there. <laughs> Guys! I know, Cody. Life in prison, that's harsh. No! No, I mean this is our last chance to go to a Diddy party! Oh my... Yo, bro. Yo, bro. Yo, bro. I'm way too tired to be overreacting. Yo, what is he talking about, bro? I was thinking about, like, uh... I know for a fact, bro, if this goofball was, like released for like maybe one day and had a party bro i know people will actually pull up bro even with what the hell it, even with all the things that are happening right now man this guy man <sighs> why am i even surprised it's cody why would you, you want to you go for it okay i think oh. you owe him a coke why would you, <laughs> you want to Guys! I know, Cody. Life in prison, that's hard. <sighs> no, no, I mean this is our last chance to go to a ditty party. Why, why, why would you, you want to my bad. You go for it. Okay. I think oh. you owe him a coke. Why would you? <laughs> <laughs> Why would you want to go to a ditty party, dude? Well, didn't you hear him? <laughs> the biggest freak off ever. Anybody who's anybody's gonna be there. Yeah, you're right. LeBron is gonna be there. He said there's no party like a ditty party. Yeah, and LeBron's a good basketball player, so he knows what he's talking about. And, and Leonardo Di DiCaprio might be there, and, and he's good at movies. So anybody who's good at anything's gonna be there. But Cody, we're not 18. We can't go to a ditty party. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> bro, we should not be joking about this, bro, but bro, all ages are allowed in that beat, bro. If only there was someone we knew that was over 18 that could chaperone us. Hey, guys! Jeffy, you have to sneak us into a ditty party. What's a ditty party? A uh, party with a big-ass bed in the backyard. With a lot of women. And men. Don't forget the men. So, boobies? Uh-huh. We're going. Yay! Hey! <laughs> Wait, but hold on, guys. We have to ask our parents' permission. What? Really? Yeah, of course. We're not 18 yet, so we gotta ask them. I'm gonna go ask my mom and dad. I'm gonna go Sure, bro. Imagine your child comes to you and talking about like, mom or dad, can I please go to a ditty party? <laughs> That's my dad. I don't have to ask anybody because I don't have parents. Well, I don't have to ask anyone either, but I'm still going to go piss off my daddy. All right, put your head in the back, baby. You don't want it to get in the way. Mom, Dad, what is it, Cody? Can I go to a ditty party? Hell no, you can't go to no damn ditty party. But why not? Well, because, Cody, me and your father are going. What? Yeah, your mama volunteers as tribute. It's true. I want a piece of ditty. No, I 
want a piece of Diddy. Well, we can both have a piece of Diddy. <sighs> Fine, but I know he's gonna choose me because I'm a man. But, but, no buts, Cody. We're saving that for the Diddy party. Come on, Tyrone. I want to be one of the first girls. All right, baby. Bring your Spider-Man butt plug. Aww. Uh, Dad? Spider-Man butt plug. Uh, what the hell is Chef Pee Pee doing with this goofball in the in the on the bed? What do you want, Junior? Me and Chef Pee Pee are about to go to the Diddy party. What, you guys are going to the Diddy party? Uh, duh. We were invited. Of course we're going. We're no losers. But I wanted to go. Uh, no, you're not going to a damn Diddy party. You're a kid, Junior. What's wrong with you? Well, I just really wanted to go. I was gonna ask your permission. Well, maybe when you're older you can go. Wait, <laughs> this is the last one. Sucks for you. <laughs> All right, Chef Pee Pee, let's go to this Diddy party. And I better not see a couple. Who's running around naked? What? Huh? Oh man. Marvin, dinner's ready. Oh man. Wait, what is this? It's an everything bagel, Marvin. What? Where's the cream cheese? No, no cream cheese. We're eating healthy now, Marvin. This is an everything bagel. It means it has everything you need in a meal. But I, I, I need cream cheese. No. Hey, Daddy, I'm going to a ditty party. No, you are not, Mister. Without me driving you. Come on. Marvin, wait. Eat your dinner first. My dad said no. My mom said no. My daddy's coming with. Fuck yeah, Marvin. I just don't want to eat an everything bagel. I'm hoping there's other food there. Is there any way we can go with you guys? Hell yeah. I don't even know what happens at these parties. <laughs> Come on. Come oh my god. Oh my goodness. Okay, this Diddy party's crazy. Yeah, I told you guys. I haven't seen Diddy yet. He's probably just getting oiled up for the big finale. Yeah, his freaky ass. Bro, what is Jeffy doing in the background, bro? Oh, look, there he is. Oh, there he's right there. Attention everybody, welcome to the Diddy party. Ain't no party like a Diddy party. <laughs> you know what you gotta do? Get filthy, get dirty. I wanna see fluid everywhere. Let's get nasty. Big, big, big man. Ass. Want people to know your name, then you got <laughs> What the fuck hook is that, bro? Let's get nasty. Big, big. Want people to know your name, then you gotta take that. You wanna taste the fame, then you gotta take that. Wanna fly on a jet, then you gotta take that. Wanna be Man, I'ma just go put the put the fries in the bag, bro. I'm not finna get my ex. I'm not offering my cheeks to get some fame or money, bro. Hell no. When that's a bet, then you gotta take that. Wanna be like Bieber, then you gotta take that. Gonna give you did it fever when you have to take that. Gonna oil up your cheeks, cause you gotta take that. Let you have a little fame, make you wanna take that. Have a party last a whole week. A week. Show you why I did it called a freak. I'm a freak. Why ah. put something in your drink? Yeah. In your drink. Then bend you over, make you turn the other cheek. Yeah. Make a quick meal from a leap. From a leap. Give daddy a little sneak peek. Let me peek. You know my stroke game on fleet. On fleet. Don't worry though, baby. I'll be me. Shut a male prostitute. Grown ass man, by the way. This man out here showing us his his, his strokes. Why is grown this grown ass man showing us his strokes? Okay, it's pause for me. Like, I can't even say nothing because why did I go back to see this man doing the strokes again? Don't worry though, baby. I'll be me. Shut a male prostitutes. I need them slicker than butter. Slick. Be careful where you walk. Don't slip in the butter at all. Cause if I catch you naked, then that booty in trouble. Need a team full of men. Tell me who wanna huddle. Who Give you the bill, cause we special. Afterwards, we gon' cut them. Another take at the parties. Are you ready to tussle? Until you start to get dizzy, don't get scared of the chuckle. I'm not gonna lie, bro. This is so effed up, bro. This song is better than KSI's new song, bro. Whatever that. I mean, I think of this stupid ass song he, he released, man. They say that they say that song was not released in escape. <laughs> get down on the knuckles, get my balls a juggle. My ball. What I'm about to do is a crime. A crime. Turn around, suck it from behind. From behind. You get loud, you let out a whine. Yeah, whine. I'm puff daddy, and now you mine. <laughs> you know Diddy gonna diddle with a mic in his hand. Banging ass like a drum, like I'm making a band. Let me oil up that ass. Cause from my stupid ass, wanna dance to this shit. <laughs> You dry in the sand, you got me so rocked up. <laughs> Take these drugs in my hand. All right, Mr. Diddy, party's over. You're under arrest for throwing a freak off when you're not supposed to be doing anything illegal. <gasps> oh, man, I better go pipe man ass before I get arrested. Diddy, no diddling. Diddy, no diddling. Diddy, no diddling. Oh, man. Now come over here and let me arrest you with these little fuzzy handcuffs you have here. Rats. Order, order, order. Well, welcome back, Mr. Diddy. Your 24 hours of freedom are up. 
and I see you've added new charges by throwing the biggest freak off ever. Was it worth it? Was it worth it? Fuck you! Yeah. <laughs> Diddy, get in there. Wait, where's my sexy ass cellmate? The judge ordered for you not to have cellmates for, you know, obvious reasons. Mm -hmm. Man, who am I use all this baby oil on? Now? How did you even get that? I strip searched you. <laughs> yes, you did, but you didn't check one place. Now take that, take that, take that. Come no, on, I'm that. good. You can keep it. Have a party last a whole week. A week. Show you what is your favorite? What? Hello. Have a party. What is your favorite music artist? My, my nigga, fuck you. I need some water, bro. I'm gonna see you next video. Call me Mascazangas, I'm a flippy bands.